you kidding me? 472,000 Venezuelans just got temporary protected status so that they could work. And with that, they get Social Security numbers. And with that Social Security number, you know what they can do? They can get a license. And with that, then they can register to vote. Let's That's not, not kidding. That is true. That is not true. That, you know what? They, there are several, points of, there are several points of identification that you can use to register to vote. One is a Social Security number and one is a license. Now, let me finish. When Biden says he's done more to secure the border and deal with the issue of immigration, according to Kareem Jean-Pierre, than anyone, that is so not true. It turns out that this past month of September, and we're not even done yet, will be the highest number of illegals coming through the border. So the question is, why are we not enforcing the law? And why, you know, everybody wants to blame everyone else. There's enough blame to go around. How do you stop this? You stop it by closing the border. You stop it by not letting them come in. You stop it. And Joe Biden did everything he could to make sure that this thing could have been, that this country can be invaded. And we are being invaded. He, he got rid of Title 42. He got rid of Remain in Mexico. He stopped the wall. Uh, he's cutting the, the Texas razor wire. The economic impact of a country like ours, where we are, what, $33 trillion in debt, and we're running a $1.3 trillion deficit. Now we have to pay for education, medication, housing. We don't even know where to put these people. And the president can't meet with the mayor of one of the biggest cities and most wealthy cities in the country, one of the most influential cities, because this is what he wants.